Ah, so you found your way to the Rish Forest. Don't let this forest fool you. It's not a place for picnics and strolls. It's a forest filled with terror and fear. Long ago, a druid named Eric came to the Rish Forest, but he was not alone. With him, he had a monstrous force of evil known as the Root Lord. Since then, and across hundreds of years, the druids of Drush have protected the world from this dreaded fiend. However, their current leader, Mother Sai, wasn't as mentally stable as her predecessors, so over time the Root Lord has managed to distort her mind, turning her paranoid and dangerous. So as Mother Sai is around, things might get damp and maybe a bit charged. When you traverse this hellish place, you're also sure to meet some of her fellow druids, determined that you shan't leave the forest alive. You'll also be greeted by rootlings inside the Rish. They are beings that were once animals, but thanks to the effect of the Root Lord, they have been converted into something a bit more aggressive. But everything is not dark and gloomy, as a new hero joins the fray, a bard named Maltas. I know what you're thinking, but Maltas is not a mere entertainer. Instead, he makes use of long-lost songs called the Mortal Sonnets. If they are sung correctly, they will leave enemies annihilated. So... If you can survive Mother Sai, the Root Lord, insane druids, and plenty of vicious rootlings, plus some other interesting beings inside this horrible forest, then you might find a special sarcophagus deep within the forest with something extraordinary inside.